Hey, good morning, everybody. Our passage this morning is Romans chapter 3, verses 21 through 31. And this passage may very well be the most important 10 verses in the Bible, the most beautiful central section of the whole Bible. Because in the passage prior, the Apostle Paul has been teaching how all of us alike are under condemnation because of our sin, that there's no one of us is perfect. But then he begins this section with the two most beautiful words we will ever hear, and it's the words, but now. But now God has made a way for us to be made right with him apart from the works of the law. And that way is through faith in what Jesus Christ has done for us on the cross. We can be made right with faith. What we could not do for ourselves, God did for us in Jesus Christ. And Paul says here that that is a sacrifice of atonement. In other words, my sin, your sin, had to be paid for. God just couldn't wink at it. He couldn't just sweep it under the rug. There had to be a payment made. Atonement had to be made. And the only way it could be made is through the one perfect sacrifice, which is God the Son, the Lord Jesus Christ. And sometimes people think that, that God, God can just hope, you know, God can just wink at her to push it aside. Couldn't happen that way. It had to be paid for and it was done on the cross, which the cross behind me in our pond represents. That's our atonement, our sacrifice of atonement. And this passage also speaks to me because it reminds me and says so clearly that none of us can earn our way to heaven by our works. It, it, it simply comes through faith. One of the most common misconceptions I think most people have as I talk with folks in various ways and places is that somehow we can earn our own way to heaven. That if our good outweighs our bad, that God will accept us that way. But every one of us alike are made right with God by only one way, and that is through faith in Jesus Christ. Doesn't matter who we are, doesn't matter where we've been, doesn't matter our ethnicity, we're made right through faith and this is the most beautiful thing that we can ever hear it is the good tidings it is the gospel it is the good news let's live it let's believe it today have a great day everybody